God does not want us to live a life under demand. Um, he says in Matthew chapter 11, come to me all who are weary and heavy laden and I will give you rest. Well, what is this? Well, where does uh, this rest come from? He says, I want to give it to you. Where does demand come from? I believe demand comes from life in general. I mean, if you want to get your needs met, you're going to have to do some things to make that happen. You know, just thinking about our needs for subsistence, you know, uh, if we don't do anything, we just kind of kick back and rest. I mean, how's that going to affect our bank account? Well, if you're in a good place with your bank account, maybe nothing, but most of us, you know, you got to, you got to perform to get something. In the world, we trade with one another to get our needs met. That puts us under demand. Well, there's even another demand for psychological needs of what makes us okay. And oftentimes what makes us okay is what we do, how we perform. And we can also get our psychological needs met by uh, people who admire what we do. They honor us for how we get out and make things happen. They honor us for our good works. And there we have it again. It's life under demand. And for some people, that works very well for them. What is Jesus getting at by saying, come to me all who are weary and heavy laden, I will give you rest. God wants to take us, Jesus wants to take us to the cross where we receive forgiveness, where we receive righteousness, not because of what we've done, how we've lived under demand and performed, but rather for what has been given to us in Christ. In a sense, he wants to take care of these needs of uh, performance. But he also says to us, you know, I want you to relax about your finances too. <laughs> you might say, well, easy for him to say, but really God is saying to us that I will take care of you. I want you to learn to relax and have some peace in your life. I want to know what you think. You know, I mean, how many people really don't want to go away from demand? They're good at it. They make things happen. And how many of us uh, live in demand and we don't want to leave it? Hey. If this video has been helpful for you, press subscribe, like, and follow. We put out two for the curious as a week. If this issue of living life under demand and how God wants to get us to a place of peace and freedom and rest would help some of your friends on your friends list, you share it, we'd appreciate that. But in any case, as we say, Salam Allah Fiyaretik, La Paz de Dias in Tu Viaje. Hey, God's peace be with you on your journey.